So ostriches don't bury their heads in the sand, but I almost did because we have no, we've had no luck with these lions. Luckily, we bumped into these beautiful zebra. Wonderful light on them now, feeding on this grass. I was beginning to become a bit worried. Just shows you, you never know what you're going to bump into around here. Look at these patterns, just wonderful, wonderful animals to see. Look at that beautiful mane on the back of the neck. Now, interesting with zebra, even though it's very dry at the moment, there is still a bit of grass around for them, but you can't really tell just by looking at zebra if they are too hungry or if they are lacking food. The reason for that is zebra build up a lot of gas in their body, so they always have that full swollen look. Look at that belly. See how full it is? They get build up a lot of gases within their body, so they always have that look. How you can tell though if the zebra is losing condition is that mane on the back. If that mane starts flapping over and falling down, that's a sign that the zebra are not healthy. These zebra, their mane is standing up nicely and they are still very, very healthy. There they go. Oh, there's another one behind there. I'm just going to move a little bit closer for us. Oh, there we go. have a look here quickly. Usually you find a single male with a group of females and I saw another zebra walk around. This is a male to the right that we're looking at now and off to the left the one that was close to us earlier that is a female. Now I'm sure some of you are asking well how do you tell the difference between a male and a female zebra? So that females walk away but if we look back at the male again under that tail, while he's swishing his tail around, you see there's actually a very, very thin black stripe from just under the tail right down through that rump. Now, that is a sign that it's a male, very, very thin stripe. The females have got a much thicker dark stripe which runs from that tail all the way down. There's also, you will then be able to see the female genitalia. Um, through that black stripe, but with the males, it's a very thin stripe if you cannot see the obvious hanging out below those back legs.